Are you interested in making an online course? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you that there's one software you can use to create the whole course, the membership barrier, the membership access, the order form, the video sales letter, all that stuff. And also, if you're a complete beginner and you don't have any of your own videos, how you can leverage videos that are already out there and make your own course. And all you got to do, stay tuned. <laughs> Hey, Thomas Garrett's here. Thanks for tuning in. I really appreciate it. If it's your first time here, definitely click that subscribe button, join the crew, and also hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of this content. I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Also, smash that like button if you enjoy this content. Anyways, before I hop into my computer and show you this, the, the software that we're going to be using is ClickFunnels. And if you have no idea what that is, it, it builds sales funnels, it builds funnels. And it's more than just a website builder or a course builder. It's so much. I have a click funnels tutorial for beginners where I show like the main parts and how to build like a funnel and kind of just things that if you don't know anything about click funnels would be very helpful. So I'll link that up above and down below for you. But definitely wait till this video is over to go watch the tutorial because I don't talk about it in the tutorial about the, making a course or the membership area. So definitely this is some valuable stuff right here and by the way click funnels is by far the best software ever created and i'm going to show you just a, a little piece of their software which is building an online course so anyways let's hop right into it okay so this is inside of click funnels so how i got here is you'd go right here you go to build funnel and always click cookbook builder process that's the the easiest way to do it as a beginner this is the old way this is the new way it's it's much easier you'd click that but i already clicked that so we're here and they have all these different funnels you can build right so the one we're going to be doing we're going to do a membership funnel so then the cool thing is in every single one of those Russell Brunson does an explanation video and it's super helpful if you don't know what you're doing. So anyways, it's super cool what he does. He just explains what every funnel is when you first get to it. Super cool. So then they have all these free templates, right? And then they have all these paid ones. I personally wouldn't mess with the paid ones. Um, but if you like one more, you can totally fine. So we're just going to choose this one, right? So then you can preview what it is like the video sales letter order form, all that stuff. So let's just hit get funnel and it takes a minute usually to go into your account. So let's just fast forward. So now we're inside of click funnels like the actual funnel. So the way they have this um, course set up, I would really honestly, I would just delete it. Honestly, <laughs> like I just don't like how they have it set up like at all. Now, what I would do is if you were charging for your course, so you would do add new step. So then you would do uh, order form, right? So then you would just do order form and then order form. So you go to sales and then you hit order form and then you just pick any of these, right? So we could do, uh, let's do video sales letter, uh, two step order form, right? So we hit edit page. So then you can see how simple this stuff is, right? So you can just delete an entire thing like that, right? delete. The most basic way to explain this is they have sections, rows, columns and elements, right? So the sections, that's the green, the rows, you see that right there, it's blue, and then the elements are orange. So then you're like, what's columns, right? So how that works is we're going to hit a new section, and you can do full width, wide, medium, small. So I don't want to get too far into that. I obviously have the tutorial that I'll link to. So we'll just do a full width section. Then inside the section, you can hit add new row. And then that's where columns is, right? So you can add however many columns, and then you can add whatever to it, right? You got a headline, you can add picture, then you can add video. So it's super simple stuff, right? So this is not how I would set it up. But basically, if you're selling your course, you would want a video sales letter. So you'd want this, and then you would want an order form like this. So you would obviously make it look better. So then how that works is you would have the video and then next to it have the order form. That's it. You want it to be simple. You want people to know what to do right so so that's how i would do that and then after that so you can either send them to an offer wall which means after they order it you send them to the wall and that's all the information they give you and that's probably how i would do it otherwise you could just like um so we'll leave that so the other way you could do it is you could just go into settings and then you go down here you hit add products okay so then you would be like this is the awesome course and I'd be like a million dollars or whatever. So, and then you can just do all that stuff. It's pretty self-explanatory. And then this would be like, thank you for your purchase. Thank you for your purchase. You may access your 
awesome course here anytime, then this is where you would put the login URL. And I'll show you that in a second. So it would be your login URL. And then you would have your, um, you'd be like, so this is if you didn't have like an offer wall telling them all the, the information right there. Or maybe you do have an offer wall, but you still want to send them an email. So then you could be like, if you had any issues with creating your account, access this link to create your account here something like that right and then you'd be like the secret login uh url or whatever it's called so then you would be like create product right so then you have this right here your your product okay so that's that obviously this stuff is probably a little confusing just watch that training if you if you do want to learn more about this stuff so then right here we'd go to the membership area see the login url so that's if people already have created their account right? So then the secret sign up URL, that's for people that haven't created their account yet. Okay, I hope that makes sense. So anyways, membership access page, that's like, you know, where you would create your account or log in. Okay, so I can show you that quick, we'll just hit edit page. And now this is this. Okay, so you can just super easily change like everything you want, right? You want to change this image, you just change it here, right? So you want to change this background, you go here, you go to settings, then you just change this background to black, right? Super easy stuff. You want to add in some type of uh, navigation you just scroll down here and you hit navigation and you want to change this you just click that change that right super super easy stuff and it's all done in click funnels drag and drop super easy stuff and it's very very powerful okay so that's that let's just go back so then for the membership area this is obviously the most important part this is the bread and butter of the entire thing right so these are just um text lessons i believe so let's just hit add new lesson section so this is your awesome course section right and then so product requirements we could say that you you have to have paid for this is your awesome course right so you have you can only see that if you've paid for this now i wouldn't do it like this i would just make a separate course for everything i wouldn't have it all in one i mean if you want to do it that's fine i guess but that's just confusing right and you can make tons of funnels right more than you'll ever need even with the 97 dollars plan i mean once if you just keep making stuff you're not using obviously you can just delete them but if you ever run out of space you can get the 297 plan and it's like unlimited okay like actually unlimited so that's that then you create lesson section so then you add new lesson okay so then we put it in this is your awesome course section right then you just do lesson one and then you select the page you would do a video lesson right because you want to use video you don't want to use a text i mean some people make text course Courses, but I bought one one time thinking it was a video course. I was pissed, right? So you don't want to do that. I think videos are definitely where the world's going. I mean, if you do any research into this stuff at all, I mean, even Facebook's going all in on video. So seriously, this is the way to go, right? So then you create lesson and now you're like, well, I don't have any of my own videos or I don't want to do my own videos or this or that. I don't like the camera. First of all, maybe get out of your comfort zone and try it right i'm not i'm not telling you to do something that you just can't do but if you've never tried it you don't know now if you are like that and you just can't do video if it bothers you that much i'll show you something you can do okay so you hit open editor so now we're inside of like the the editor for that single video right so it's basically like the same thing it's all just drag and drop so you can just delete stuff like delete that whole thing right and if you, you add something just add a column add a new element this is like a pair paragraph talking about it you could add new element you could do like links or like a divider and then you could just you know what I mean so it's super simple stuff so how I was talking about earlier about leveraging other people's videos if that's something you really really can't do now let me show you because this is super powerful stuff and YouTube allows this right so let's say you're making an SEO course right okay so what you would do is you would go right here you would take the URL and then we go back to this and then you would just go to YouTube and then you put the URL, okay? And then you'd hit save. So now that should work, so let's go back. Okay, so now that we added that right there, right? So we added the section, then we added the video. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go open an editor. Actually, I didn't wanna do that, but whatever. So we'll just hit preview right here. Here's the lesson we created, and you can see the videos right there, okay? So then you can write stuff under it, whatever. But this stuff's super powerful, so you can add in each section, you can have a number of lessons in the section. You can make them smaller, however you want to do it. 
And you can do this all with the power of just one software. So I hope this stuff is making sense. If you have any problems at all, just let me know in the comments down below. I can help you with anything you need. And that's, I mean, that's pretty much the gist of it. I mean, that's how you make a course using ClickFunnels. <laughs> it's super simple stuff. And that's how you could use other people's videos from YouTube and make your own course with the videos and put everything in one spot for people. You're providing them a service. You're putting all the best YouTube videos in one spot for them. Now, however, let me be clear on one thing though. I mean, it's totally up to you. I don't know the, the rules or the laws or anything, honestly, but I wouldn't charge anyone if you're using their content from YouTube. However, there are ways to make money by putting their content on your free course. First of all, by making a free course and putting all the information in one spot for people, you're getting their email, which you can market to them. And also inside of the membership area in the course, you can have your affiliate links and link to products that are related. And that's how you can make money by having their content there. Because obviously they're still getting the views and whatnot, but don't charge people when you're using their content. That's kind of messed up in my opinion. So just, just don't be slimy when you go about it because that's just not right. You know what I mean? So I, I hope that makes sense. And also I just really wanted to thank you for watching and if you really do want to learn about click funnels that training will be up above or down below i'll put in the end card as well and then i also have another video that goes in depth for affiliate marketing and i have a free training everything will be like somewhere in this video It'll be up above down below at the end card but yeah if you enjoy this stuff definitely check that stuff out it's a lot of free content and i hope you'd enjoyed it so i'll end it with that until next time <laughs>